EastEnders 2018 kicked off with a bang with Mick Carter, Danny Dyer, getting shot. The creepy Irishman had been organizing a crime plot for weeks which involved his henchman Vincent Hubbard, Richard Blackwood, Keno Taylor, Danny Walters, Phil Mitchell, Steve McFadden, and Mick. However despite weeks of intense planning the plot to rob a van passing through Albert Square failed and Mick ended badly hurt. Mick's wife Linda Carter, Kelly Bright, and Shirley Carter, Linda Henry, happened to be around the corner and rushed to save the Queen Vic landlord. And while that commotion was going on Vincent was left alone in the arches with Aidan. In a major plot twist, Aidan pulled a gun on him. Aidan blamed Vincent for the death of his brother Connor. Back in the day, Connor was one of Vincent's accomplices in a drugs ring. However when caught, Vincent sang like a canary to police in return for a lighter sentence and Aidan's brother landed up inside. Connor suffered in prison and ended up taking his own life and Aidan had been plotting his revenge the whole time. In 2010 one Vincent Hubbard turned in three accomplices in a drug ring in return for a reduced sentence, he said pointing the gun at Vincent's head. One of those lads was my brother Connor, they sent him up north to a dog hole with nonces, ponces and terrorists, away from his mates. He couldn't take it two months and he killed himself, how do you plead? But Aidan was stopped in his tracks by gun-toting Phil Mitchell who burst in after working out what Aiden had planned. He managed to talk Aiden out of it, but he would have to sell off the Albert and give the proceeds to him. EastEnders continues tomorrow night at 8pm on BBC One, C1.